Hi friends, Tina did it here and welcome back to my channel. This project is going to be super simple. It's literally a last minute Father's Day gift. We already have our Father's Day gift ready, but my son wanted something with their picture. So here's what I came up with. So if you wanna see how I made this, keep on watching. So I'm starting off with a shadow box from Dollar Tree. Everything in this video is from Dollar Tree and here's the barcode. Just in case you'd like to order it from online, I believe they are available online. I'm not 100% sure. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out the backing and I'm going to take out the little stars, um, the confetti inside. I will not be using the stars, but I will be saving them for another DIY. Obviously this project was super simple and definitely affordable and perfect for kids. You can put this along with a gift card, a few balloons. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab a few balloons on Father's Day and have my son give him the frame along with the balloons and the other gifts that we have for him. But basically, like I said, I'm going to take out the stars and make sure you give it a little shake because even when I took out, when I thought I took out all the stars, um, there was still some falling out so you don't want to end up with stars in there still and if you want to keep the stars in there that's totally up to you but i ended up saving those for a different diy now that's done i'm going to take out one of the papers that were in the backing and i'm going to basically just trace on this um cardstock paper i went with blue but you can also use fabric and um use it in the as a background in the frame but i ended up using the cardstock paper i mean you could also um use something maybe blue and white stripes or um, like I said, any cute fabric, you can Mod Podge it onto the cardboard in the back. But for me, I ended up going with this cardstock paper. But you can definitely customize the background and make it your own. And here I am shaking the frame again because I'm like, there is something inside. And here you have it, tons of stars. <laughs> so like I said, if you don't want the stars being part of the project, just make sure you get them all out of there. Before I forget to mention, if you like videos that are straight on point and cute and simple projects like this one, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you're notified every time I upload a video. Now I'm going to take my tacky glue and I'm going to apply glue onto the cardboard. I ended up tossing the other papers out, by the way, I'm only using the backing, the, the cardboard part. So I'm just applying glue and I'm going to put my paper on top of that and let it dry. Now I'm going to set that aside to dry like I said and now I'm going to take these cubes, the little cubes from Dollar Tree. I believe it comes 36 pieces in a pack and yes that's from Dollar Tree. I believe it's already on the website. Um, so yeah so I had my son write Happy Father's Day on each cube, the letters of course and what we're going for here is the Scrabble look. So, um, so yeah, so I'm going to take their picture. I did cut it a bit. I made it a little bit smaller. It's a four by six, but I still ended up cutting it. And I just basically have a simple picture, but my son loves this picture. I think they were at the zoo or some kind of park together and they had parrots. I was too scared to even come near that parrot, but, <laughs> but, um, but yeah, they had parrots on their heads. So he definitely loves that picture. So that's what I ended up using. And, um, yeah, so this is a very easy project for kids to do and my son definitely loves it and he's happy to give this to his dad. So yeah, so I just went in with the cubes now. I'm just going to sort of figure out how I'm going to place them and I think I'm just going to go one up, one down because I think it gives it a better look that way. And now I'm just going to give it a try with the frame just to make sure everything is visible from the glass. And now that I know how I'm going to place them, I'm going to go in with my hot glue. And the easier way to do this is to glue the cubes together first and then glue the entire thing down on the paper. And since this is a shadow box, you guys, you can put a toy hammer in there or a small screwdriver or daddy's favorite sport. So get creative and you can toss anything in there you want or you can add some lights and make the shadow box light. Um, so yeah, so get creative and make it your own. Now, since my background is a little bit simple, I decided to add a few screws in there and that's pretty much it. I mean, it's, it is a shadow box, so you can just throw the screws in there. You don't have to glue it onto the back. 
and that's pretty much it i know it's a super simple project but um while i was making this with my son i thought about it i'm like maybe i should videotape this this might help someone out so yeah so if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more fun diys and make sure to share with your friends thank you all for watching see you all next time bye